I have to admit I was dreading it because I was wondering if I, uh, if I had my chops, shall we say. But uh, I love this place and I've played here before in Roth House. And uh, of course the sound in this room is beautiful and the, the visual surroundings are beautiful. Um, there's a great team of people here to uh, visually and audibly <laughs> record the, the, uh, the performance and that's certainly very reassuring. The first time I heard Schlievenamon was uh, when my first Illin Pipes teacher, Tommy Carney from Dunreese in County Waterford played it. And uh, I ended up recording uh, or creating a recording of Tommy uh, playing that and many other tunes as well. Hunting the Hare is a, a slip jig, a simple little thing. And uh, I played it with my good musician friends, Donald Clancy and Kieran Summers in a band called Piper's Union for a while.
It's very difficult for festivals, it's very difficult for uh, theatres, venues, I mean the Kilkenny Arts Festival encompasses all those things for performers, for administrators, for uh, arts uh, uh, people in general. Uh, it's lovely to see Kilkenny manage to use its position in this town and its position with artists and with engineers and with everybody involved in presenting the arts in such a uh, good and professional way. Uh, the hornpipes, uh, the first one is called uh, On Chan Van Vocht and that's a great tune of multiple parts. Uh, the first time I heard it was uh, in the hands of Liam O'Flynn and a bootleg recording that I got from somebody and uh, Liam O'Flynn played it fabulously. I haven't played that tune for a while but uh, it occurred to me that uh, it might be a good one to play. And after that then a tune called the Leitrim Thrush and I got that from a piper in uh, County uh, Leitrim called uh, Peter Carberry.
to know with Philip Fahey. And it's, it's kind of one of the big game airs of the. Right. And talks about the I love the rhythm of it because it's not kind of. Regular, Almost not structured at all. It's a beautiful all. sort of it, organic shape to it. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. Ennis would have lifted that from the singer. Right. Do you know so he's. Philip Shave of Fahig is, uh, has its origins in West Waterford and it's an old um, Gaelic song uh, that mentions all the great Irish uh, families. Uh, it's about uh, gentle noble Philip Fahy is what uh, it means in English. And it, the melody is a version of Sean O'Deary Lana. Um, Seamus Ennis uh, would have collected it from La Ross O'Kyla up in the Cumbria Mountains in West Waterford, where I'm from. And when I was learning my musical trade, I would have studied it with uh, the great uh, Gaelic scholar Seamus McCrath from Unrhyme. We don't care about it. <laughs> okay.
The first reel is called the Salamanca and uh, it's followed by the steam packet. Uh, the Salamanca is you know, a reference to the Napoleonic uh, uh, Wars and many of the Irish tunes are named with references to the, those wars and campaigns. And then the steam packet uh, was a favourite uh, tune of an elderly gentleman, um, Cristoro Canela from Unrying and he used to always ask us to play it. But I recorded those two uh, tunes on my first album which is called My Love is in America. Oh no, if you're happy with the